Welcome back everyone, it's time to lock down another Booster Cracking Sunday, and we're getting into the last few boxes of Rebirth of Legend, these phenomenal little perfectly 2.0 booster boxes of the Saga Cluster, which are absolutely wonderful. Genius Move by Force of Will and I Spy Productions, the company that makes them. Good job to you guys. Kudos, kudos. We got two more from the whole case that we have been cracking into. If you haven't seen the last few videos that we've been doing of Rebirth of Legend, go check those out in the playlist, Sunday Booster Crackings. I'm sure there'll be links in the description and everything as well. But let's jump in to the second to last box and see what we can find. I think we've pretty much hit all the full arts, but that's okay. We're just trying to get as many doubles as we can, you know? And you cannot forget about the wonderful J Ruler box toppers that we've been finding. And so far we've had no duplicate J Ruler box toppers, which is pretty crazy. So maybe we'll see that too. I, I don't even know. All right, let's get this plastic off here. There we go. Thank you, thank you. And let's do the reveal of what J Ruler box topper we will find. Kaboom! Oh, yeah, all right. We've got Oborozuki Star Sword Visionary. Hell yeah, this is such a sweet card. Honestly, it is really dope. Look at that artwork on that one. Let's pop it out, come on. Come on, no duplicates so far. We've got one more box, so I'm a happy camper right now. But check out this one, Oborozuki Star Sword Visionary. Really, really sweet. Awesome J-Ruler, really nice foiling on that one. Cool artwork, there's the flip, there's the other side. Dope looking card. Don't know what this one's valued at. I'm pretty sure it's gotta be like 25. I know Obrazuki was one of the more expensive ones in the Saga, uh, Epic of the Dragon Lord Saga cluster. So we'll see, we'll see, but that is dope. Remind you, I bought these boxes in pre-release when they were only 35 bucks and they've gone up to like 70 bucks now. So basically, any J Ruler you pull, if you did the pre-release and got them before they were sold out, just pays for the box, which is insane. It's just insane. All right, first pack, let's go. Let's see what we can find. Does anybody know if there were God Packs in this set? I have no clue if there were. Get the zoom in going. All right, yeah, let me know. If anybody's found a God Pack, that'd be absolutely insane in this box, in these little sets, that'd be crazy. Marabella, sincere teacher engineer, not teacher engineer. Uh, good one to get, better in the full art, but I will take it probably like $8 still or something like that. And then True Demon Castle, very nice. I love the foiling on this one. It is very sick. Next one, let's go. All right, ripping into it. Let's see what we can find. We've got our Pearl Shine. Uh, how many did I get of you already? I don't even know. And uh, we got Abel a couple times. We got Valentina twice over now. And Ragnarok Fiery Stone, this is our third copy of it. I'm gonna have a full play set of Ragnarok Fiery Stone by the end of this, I swear. And I'm gonna be happy. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but uh, I, I would love to play with this card if I ever start building decks eventually. <laughs> I'll take it though, I'll take it. That is a sweet looking card. But right now we're getting into the next pack. We got Training Grounds, the True Demon Castle again. Freyla, I need to get a second copy of her. I will take a second copy all day of her. Behind it though, we got a Foil Dragon. Dracula, which is fantastic for Marvel rares in the foiling. Uh, I think it lowered a little bit. I'm gonna guess it's probably like at 15, 16 bucks. If it's higher than that, dope. If not, cool. Hey, we gotta level out the playing field eventually here. Prices are coming down. Woo, next one, let's get into it. We got Pearl Shine Panda. We got Abdul Alvarez, Grim and Pandora, and another Shoxy, yes. I'll take her all day too, man. She is a dope looking card. Mercenary Queen, oh, it's so cool. Love this card. Next pack, let's go, come on, I'm sweating up here, oh my goodness. Abel, turn off the fan for like two minutes and you're just boiling. All right, we got Magna as our, uh, not our rare, our Marvel rare. Should have some value, I forget where he's at though. But we got Pearl Shine Panda Boy over here, El Dorado as our nice full art, very cool, very cool. Next pack, let's go. We got the Melfi sitting on top the cane and the flute and the Rezard. Not bad. What's behind it though? We got Lumia, the cover girl herself, as a wonderful one. It is uh, pretty expensive in the foil, actually. Don't know where it'll be at in a couple weeks when I actually release this video. I'm pre recording because I'm going on vacation. <laughs> So hopefully everything gets out on time. But uh, this has got to be still like a 20 bucker at least, for sure. I don't know if you guys noticed or saw the last video, but I teased this little sucker that came in the mail for me. Very rare box and set, the Time Spinning Witch, and I got two of them. So if you want to see me open that soon, get ready and subscribe because I don't think I'm going to be able to resist the urge to get into that box. It's uh, one I've been waiting to open for a while. Let's get into the next pack, though. We've got Abdul. We got Celestia. The Alvarez, the Yadrazil, uh-oh, and who's behind it? We've got Luna, 
master guide really sharp card oh, man this thing just pops it just like blinds you when you look at it this one oh my gosh look at that bam 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 you're blind you're blind you're done you can't see anything next one let's go oh it's wanting to be stuck don't bend my cards please all right Ferica, very nice celestia very nice lumia even by herself she's got to be like 12 bucks i think perfect and then Kirk's Trading Ground, not as expensive, but okay, sure, they can't all be winners. Oh my goodness me, we've only got two packs left already. Oh my gosh, let's go. First one, let's get into it. All right, I saw some purples at the end. Maybe we'll get Freyla again. Uh, we got Sylvia Lilius, and behind it, yeah, I called it, it was Freyla. All right, let's go. I love this card, man. Ah, it's so sharp, it's so cool looking absolutely adore this card and artwork very very well done I feel like i say that on every single card but i'm sorry <laughs> it can't be helped all right last one let's see oh 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 oh! i'm showing it off oh boy what what did we just see at the end there abel and oh i think i know what it is i think it's valentina oh it, no it's not a very similar uh color palette though it's, uh it's celestia's tremendous treasure trove as our full art I think it's only like three bucks. It's fine. It's fine. It's chill. It's cool. I'll take it. I'll take it. Really quickly, we'll hop into the polls of the day. Just my faves of the faves. Firstly, of course, it's the Fiery Stone Ragnarok. Beautiful card. We got our Marvel Rares with Dracula, and then also the Cover Girl Lumia, which is a great card to get. Good, good price on that one. Luna Master Guide, one of my faves for the full arts. And then, of course, Freyla. Can't forget Freyla. She is dope as heck. And then our big one, the Maker Breaker. It's Obrozuki Star Sword Visionary from Epic of the Dragon Lord as our box topper. Wonderful, wonderful box. Oh, yes. I hope you guys enjoyed and make sure to stay tuned because next week we are going to be on to the last little box of Rebirth of Legend and then that's it. We're done. We're out of boxes. It's crazy. But hopefully you guys have been enjoying them. Go check out the previous ones if you haven't. And yesterday we opened up some Crazy Bone McDonald toys, which uh, if you want nostalgia for both ends, Mickey D toys plus 90s, 2000s Crazy Bones, if you're involved in that, come check out the video. It was a lot of fun. And uh, yeah, make sure to subscribe for more crazy nostalgic videos and more Force of Will. We're swapping in and out, going in back and forth, whatever we want to do. So stay tuned for that. And thank you guys for watching. Appreciate all the support you guys have been given. And we will see you guys in the next video.